Tonight, Lexington deputies say a man's been arrested for breaking into a Red Bank church and assaulting a woman. He took some sort of rock, threw it through one of the sliding glass doors there. That's how he got into the church, uh, was based on the information that we have gathered thus far, was in there rummaging around trying to find some items to steal, and then that's when he encountered the employee. At that point, in trying to, to get away, he uh, grabbed something from the employee and then hit the employee in the, in the face. Well, our street squad team in Lexington, they've been following the story out of Red Bank. Nick Jones was able to sit down with the woman who was attacked and has her story tonight. I'm just afraid that um, they would have got hurt. But I'm glad it was me instead of them and that he didn't have a chance to go because the kids were already in the building. Glenda Snellgrove considers herself blessed after she says she was attacked at Red Bank United Methodist Church Monday morning. She's a teacher for the church's school pre-K program and was walking into work with her cousin. I felt like somebody was all over me and he grabbed the boot and it was just like a blur and um, he started hitting with me and this is made out of a hard plastic. Snellgrove just recently had surgery on her foot over Christmas and was carrying her boot to put on inside the building. While she says she was being assaulted, she knew she had to think quick. I didn't have time to be scared. I was mad. And I thought about my cousin, that something like this happened to her, and I'm like, if this is going to be something going on, buddy, we're going. Snellgrove says she was then able to fight off the attacker and call 911. The Lexington County Sheriff's Department says they were later able to arrest 20-year-old James Douglas Drayton in connection with the assault. Deputies say he's being charged with first-degree assault and second degree burglary. Now Snell Grove is left with bruises and scars remembering what happened. He hit me here and he hit me back on the temple and I found this this morning. I've got a, a big long, it's kind of like how the plastic is on the boot here. There's a knot, there's knots here. She says she's glad none of the other teachers or students were hurt and she's ready to move forward. That's what I told a lady on 911. I said, there's kids in this building and there's more coming. It's really sad that people get to that and they need Jesus, that's all it is to it. Reporting for Street Squad Lexington, I'm Nick Jones.